all the Jeppy uh, Boats and Blades community. Uh, my name is Simon Moore and I'm the Director of Rowing at uh, Jeppy Boys High School. And yeah, I just wanted to provide you, I suppose, another update, which um, at this stage is kind of the pre-SA Champs um, update. Yeah, today is uh, it's Wednesday today, so SA Champs starts in just over a week and a half. Um, yeah, which is very exciting and I think we all the whole club is very excited to see how the how, how everybody can perform uh, next weekend, which is great. Um, but just wanted to give you an update yeah, on the m more recent regattas. Uh, so we returned from the Buffalo Regatta on the thirteenth of on the thirteenth of Feb, having had a fantastic regatta all round. Um, you know, I think more than anything, our results were were pretty. Yeah, we were very happy with the results. Um, we managed to achieve a silver medal in the eight. Um, you know, again, Damascus just showing its metal there. And, and again, a huge thank you to all those who, who've contributed to the purchase of this beautiful boat. Um, you know, it really has gone a long way in, in boosting the morale of our opens and our first team. And I don't think, you know, I think without it, um, you know, we'd be in a very different position. So yeah, fantastic to see, to see that boat moving so nicely. Uh, also silver medal in the under 19 single skull, um, which is fantastic and silver medal in the and the 19 uh, coxed fours, which for us, you know, were, were the highlight results um, of the of the regatta. And I mean, JP actually hadn't been down to Buffalo, I believe, since about 2016, 2017. So, you know, just for, so, no, so nobody who actually went on this tour has ever gone to Buffalo before. So I think just from an educational point of view and from a touring point of view, it had, you know, such value. And, and we really hope it's going to have a lasting impact on our boys in terms of keeping them within their own community, because it's such a fantastic regatta and experience that um, you know it stays with that regatta stays with people for a long time so we really really hope it's going to stay with our boys and stand them in good stead um, yeah and then last weekend we we were lucky enough to have another junior regatta unfortunately at this stage um, Wema Pan is in addition to Rotoplatz is also closed down um, due to a, an E. coli water quality issue so um, so this weekend was actually planned to be a Wema regatta, but um, unfortunately that had been cancelled. And, and last weekend they managed to host a junior regatta at um, Homestead Lake, which is in Benoni, so nice and close to Jeppe. Which, yeah, again for our juniors, it was only the second regatta of this whole season, or you know, for many of our under four teams, their second regatta ever. And yeah, again we were, you know, we came out with various kind of silvers and golds, um, you know, in the various age groups and, and races. So yeah, again. Fantastic effort from the boys and the club and, and just a fantastic experience overall that I think uh, the boys have had. So yeah, so now we, it's, you know, we've got no more regattas in front of us barring SA Champs. Um, and yeah, everybody's working really hard and kind of doing, putting on the finishing touches at this stage. Um, you know, with not a lot of training time, you often dedicate that last um, little bit of time for, you know, tapering and making sure everybody's bodies are at the top of their game for, for these big races. So yeah, unfortunately, well, fortunately slash unfortunately, SA Champs is being held at, at VLC, so it will be over one, one kilometer, which obviously isn't the national championship um, distance. But um, yeah, I think we can really take fantastic lessons out of what we achieved at Buffalo and hopefully convert that into, into the smaller distance. Um, you know, overall, I think the spirits in the club is really, really good at the moment. And, you know, the results are coming. And, you know, the special bonds that I think are being formed by the boys, and most importantly, is, is there, you know, as a, as a classic rowing club. Um, you know, guys are friends off the water as well as on the water. And, yeah, we can really see, as coaches in front of our eyes, those long-lasting friendships really, really being developed, um, which is, yeah, which is just fantastic to see. Yeah, so once again, we thank you, you know, all of you guys out there, the broader row, uh, JP Rowing community. A big thanks to all your support and all your help. And yeah, we really, if you're in the greater Johannesburg re region, really invite you to come come along um, from the 4th to the 6th of March to come watch SA Champs. And yeah, and, and be great to see for you to see you guys and, and for you guys hopefully to see the JP Rowing Club in action and yeah, and hopefully achieving, you know, their, their own individual goals. And um, yeah, really looking forward to some, some good racing out there. All right, otherwise, wishing everybody a fantastic rest of the day and the week. And yeah, I'm sure we'll, we'll uh, send out the latest update after SA Champs. All right, have a good one. Cheers. Bye.